the K-12 Educators Data Guidebook um, is for educators who in this day and age have to use data. Sometimes they want to use data because they enjoy it and other times they don't. But um, at either rate, uh, the modern educator has data as part of their job. And so being a guidebook, it's a how-to manual, um, but it's also a collection of stories about how educators have come to use data um, and a conversation about how we can reimagine that so it feels more positive and practical as an experience. So I'm thinking primarily of two audiences uh, and then a smaller audience, which I'll, uh, you know, which I'll talk about here at the end. The first one um, it is school site level educators. Teachers are the obvious choice, but also um, support providers, um, anybody who works with students directly. Um, and it's a practical handbook and companion for data use for those folks. Uh, also thinking of school site leaders, district office leaders. Um, and for anybody who is a leader in charge of building and nurturing a positive data culture uh, in their organization, I think this book could be great for them. I'm thinking particularly of the activity section that you can use for staff development. Uh, a great place to start would be the chapter on psychological safety, how to make data use a more positive uh, and safe experience uh, for practitioners. And then finally, if you are a data expert, somebody who enjoys using data and for whom uh, data use on its own is a rewarding experience, I think the book is a good example about how you can invite a much wider audience into the conversation, which uh, if you're a big believer in collaboration like I am, um, is an important thing because we need all kinds of folks in the conversation about how we use data, including folks who, um, for whom data is not their main job. Okay, so I think you got some choices about how you can teach the book. I deliberately wrote it so that you can, you can uh, pick from a few different ways. Um, I'll start with the quickest one, which is every chapter has activities that you can use to practice the concepts. And uh, there's even an appendix in the back of the book that collects a bunch of different additional activities that, that are sort of extra supplementary things. Um, and so you could start there if you just wanted something practical to do with students. I think the next thing that you can do is uh, you can open it up to any chapter um, and I designed it so you can get something out of that single chapter independent of the others. So uh, if you're pressed for time, you can feel free to pick just a few chapters and go deep on the concepts in that chapter with your students. Uh, and then finally, um, if you are the type of person or if you're teaching a class and you want for folks to read it cover to cover, um, I wrote it so that there is a narrative that winds its way through the entire book that I hope uh, is inspiring and rewarding. Um, and I think the book is a good experience that way also. The biggest advice that I can give for students um, is make this book your own book. Um, whatever your school data related needs are, um, if you read a story in it that makes you uh, respond emotionally, speaks to you, grab a pen and circle it, um, write your reaction to it in the margins. If you find an activity that you want to do, dog ear that page. Uh, if you find an idea that speaks to you or, or even one that you disagree with, um, write why in the margins, scribble notes and, and, and work your process out in the book uh, because it's your book and I wrote it for you. Um, one of the things uh, that I've been thinking about is uh, my goal to make this book a book about data, but one that has some heart in it. So. Um, I imagine if at least one person uh, shows me their copy and it's been beat to heck from reading and writing and referencing it, then I'll know that you have experienced it the way that I had designed it to be experienced. It's really important to me when I wrote the K-12 Educators Data Guidebook to make the most human approach possible uh, to writing a book about using data in schools. Um, and so there are lots of stories and there are lots of them are my own personal stories. Um, but there are even more from educators um, out in the field uh, and, you know, from leaders and, you know, data experts and data non-experts. 
Um, and so I do think of this as a data book. It's a how-to manual, um, but I think what makes it different, I hope what makes it different is that it's a data book with heart. It's about using data with heart, finding personal connection and personal meaning in the way that we serve our students using all the tools that we have, uh, but data in particular.